breaking the wall of fruit and vegetable waste. Stani Khamiliasson, Falling Walls Lab, Madagascar. Three months ago, I found some rotten bananas in my kitchen. It was rotten because I completely forgot about it. In larger scales, fruit and vegetable waste can make much more damages. In Madagascar, last year, the producers themselves thrown away more than 9,000 tons of leeches. But on the other hand, according to the Food and Agriculture Organization, seven out of ten children from Madagascar are suffering from malnutrition. Those fruit and vegetables producers can't afford specific materials, such as freezers, and they don't have electricity neither. During the harvest time especially, middlemen set the price as they see fit, so sometimes producers are selling at a loss. And to bring those fruits and vegetables from rural areas to major cities is very difficult because our roads are in terrible conditions. Due to all of that, here is midahiri, which means to store in English. Our co-product is a solar dryer made with locally available and affordable materials, wood and recycled metal sheet. The air helps it High temperature takes away all the moisture of the products. And it takes only eight hours to dry 20 kilos of fruits for one dryer. We also aim to train those, those fruit producers on uh, low energy drying techniques. And we have already done so for uh, 35 producers in the south of Madagascar. The dry products can be stored for two years in the same conditions while the fresh one can be stored for only two weeks. And the transportation is much more easier because we go from this to that. And it means that the volume is reduced to one tenth. And those producers can sell at an appropriate price all year long and directly to the customers. So, to fight malnutrition, join our revolution of storage innovation. Thank you.